All right, so here's Eight Mile that we're passing by now. What does the pedal pub look like on the screen? Oh, oh my God. Can the Tesla detect the pedal pub? I'm just letting the car do what it wants, so, oh. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. So today we're gonna head down to Detroit. I wanna test out autopilot and kind of some Detroit traffic and see how it does in that area. It is a Saturday, so it's not gonna be a rush hour, but we do have a lot of construction. There's still always, you know, a good amount of traffic down there. So we'll see how the car handles that. Um, and then I'm gonna go pick up my buddy Sam. Uh, we're gonna kind of drive around the city and check some different stuff out. There will be timestamps in the description if you wanna skip around. All right, so heading down to Detroit, let's uh, navigate first. So I got a tip uh, in a comment from a previous video that if you click the scroll wheel after you're done uh, saying your directions, it goes a lot faster, so let's try it. Navigate to Eastern Market. Okay, awesome, that's a lot faster. So that's, that's pretty cool, thank you for that comment. So it's about 60 miles, I've already done some of the driving uh, before I started recording, but there is a supercharger here in Livonia that's uh, actually on my way back if I take a different route home, so I may check that out. But you can see down here there is some crazy traffic, it looks like on some parts of I-75 um, there's going to be a good amount of traffic. So we'll see how the car handles that. Uh, let's get on the highway. All right, we're getting on to 75 here. Still a while before we get to Detroit. So I'll let the car do the on-ramp and the merging and everything. But even, okay, it's starting to speed up, so that's pretty good. But like that guy in front of me, that's like an old person. They were going really slow and they're still. So here, it's like time to go and the car's not. Yeah, that, see, okay, it hit 70 kind of right as we got on. So really that's not terrible. So I am using Navigate on Autopilot, it's selected here, so the car will do lane changes and things for me. So my settings in Autopilot, I keep it on average. I find Mad Max is a little annoying, it uh, changes lanes too often, but you know I, I do get a lot of comments asking me to try it, so for today I'll change it to Mad Max and, and see how it does. All right, so this yellow guy up here is going a little slow. So now we're going to get over. So that was nice. Again, Mad Max doesn't change how aggressively the car switches lanes. It just changes um, how often it decides to, to change lanes. All right, so the car put us in the passing lane. And it should get us out of here. But I think, I think this guy maybe is a little too close. Nope, here we go. All right, so it took us out of the passing lane, so that's good. All right, so this guy's going too slow for us, so we should, that's good. Oh man, really good didn't hesitate at all. Now we should be getting out of the passing lane. I don't know what we're waiting for. I'm just going to do it manually. So I hit the turn signal and then now the car's doing it. There's just, there's somebody behind me. They're not, you can tell they're not very close. They're not trying to pass me, but I don't like to sit in that lane. All right, so our first little bit of construction is coming up here. Let's actually see how the car handles this since there's not too much traffic. Oh, actually, no, okay, so I just want to see if it'll react to these barrels at all. So let's slow down. Oh, okay, they painted a new line here for us, so that's pretty nice. Oh uh, yeah, so the car doesn't have any problem dealing with that. Okay, that was really good. All right, so this part of the construction, they've painted new lines here. Um, they're solid, so the car will not auto-change lanes. Like, if I put the turn signal on, the car won't go anywhere. Um, and we're sometimes crossing over the old lines, but so far the car has not gotten confused by it at all. Oh, that turn signal, but they don't know their turn signal's on. Oh yes, they do, they did get over. So the car, at least in that instance, you can see, does not see turn signals. 
I'll admit I have it a few times where somebody turns their turn signal on and I mean I swear the car does seem to slow in response to it but I really think those instances are just coincidences all right so really good over all those kind of goofy lines Check this out see that bridge it says city of Auburn Hills all right that's cool on our way to Detroit but then what is that in the distance above the trees? Well, that is the Chrysler building. So, if you're in Detroit, you may know, Chrysler abandoned Detroit long ago. They're in Auburn Hills now. So off to the right here. Oh, it's closed. <laughs> like every ramp here. Uh, well, that's the way to get to Pontiac normally, but if you want an autopilot and Pontiac video, just comment down below and let me know. I'll find some way to get into Pontiac. So we just got our construction detected message up here. Even though, okay, that was weird. It was gonna change and then it abandoned. Um, well, we've had construction for a while and it just started detecting it when it's farther from the cones. I actually don't even technically know where Detroit starts. I, th I think it's eight mile. I'm gonna, I'm gonna text Sam and find out. All right, I safely pulled over and sent him a text and he said that yes, south of eight mile, uh, Telegraph is the border, which like, I knew that. I just forgot. So this is pretty crazy. We're in Mad Max and we've been behind these guys going slow for a pretty good amount of time. I'm not sure why the car doesn't want to change lanes. I, to be honest, I really don't mind. Okay, there's that. Um, so we're finally going to go around them. Oh, no, it keeps canceling. Hmm. Oh my gosh, this road is a mess. If Autopilot can do okay on this road, I think we're going to be all right. This is crazy. So we have this wall to our left that the car doesn't seem to care about at all. You can see that it senses it. The ultrasonics are detecting uh, the wall there. That's what those little um, kind of signals mean. Um, but it's staying in the lines despite this like terrible road that has lines all over the place. <laughs> Alright, so here's 8 Mile that we're passing by now. First made famous by M&M's. The candy. So I'm going to turn off, well I'm going to change um, my settings back to average. Mad Max has just been kind of annoying this whole drive. <laughs> See a pretty low percentage of foreign cars around this area. Oh wow, okay, yeah there's a lot of traffic up here so this should get pretty interesting. Okay, so we are going to change, looks good. Wow, that was good. We like slowed to match this red car speed as we got in the lane. That was really good. Okay, so another change. This guy's kind of in our way, but he is letting us in. Cool. And you can kind of see the city up here, but um, Michigan is pretty flat. So you can't see too far at a time. But there's the GM building up there on the right. That's where I want to end up. Okay, and here's our exit, Mac Avenue. That's my screen name on AOL and Messenger if you need to reach me. Mac Avenue. So the car is taking the exit. Slowing a little early. And navigate on autopilot is done, but the car is still in control steering us. I'm going to hit the accelerator just because someone's behind us and they are going to be confused. So I will take over at this point. So the car handled I-75 really well. I, I tried to keep this camera up for you as much as I could, but I needed to know where I was going as well. Maybe there's some kind of, I don't know, something I can set up to so you guys can see out of the back too. Let me know if you have any ideas. I really don't want to edit any more <laughs> video feeds together, but uh, I'll, I'll try. I don't know, maybe there's some type of mirror or something. Huge hole in the road, we'll avoid, oh my gosh, we'll avoid those. Oh my gosh, stop it. <laughs> no, <laughs> can't avoid them all. Okay, so we're gonna turn left here. I got there first, but that's fine. Dang, guys, on a unicycle, that is sick. All right, I'm gonna send my location to Sam on Google Maps so he knows exactly where I am. There's the people. <laughs> I don't get to see that very often. I'm pretty much always driving on the highway and not in cities, so I don't see, you know, people up on this display. That's very cool. 
next test will autopilot stop for people. Any volunteers? All right, so we are here. This is Eastern Market. Hello. Hey, you just uh, you just passed me. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. I'll I'll just stop right here. Uh, sure. Okay, I'm stopped. Right. What's up? Nothing. Oh, door open in hold mode. Oh snap! What up? What's going on? Nothing. This is Sam. Yep. This is who uh, makes all the music. Yep. For the channel. <laughs> So, you thank you it. for that. All right, let's get going. Saw a guy riding a unicycle on the way here. Yeah? Yeah, it was pretty sweet. <laughs> You want to go downtown first or drop the stuff at my place and then go? Um, whatever you want. I really don't care. Yeah, so let's go into the city, just get some sweet shots and show the people cool. around. Cool. Um, um, I want to hit, of course, this way. GM building. Okay. The Ren I want to yep. go to. And then uh, there's not like a Ford building, or is there? Uh, there is in Dearborn. <laughs> oh, yeah. But it's like boring office building. Yeah, we don't not want that. No, no, no. Like, straight. Straight. Yeah. The, the GM building is sweet because it's like a huge towering, yep. you know building that says GM at the top. Yep. There's nothing like that about Ford. Mm -hmm. And I already told them about Chrysler abandoned Detroit long ago, so. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we don't like them so much. I mean, <laughs> FCA is still here in some left capacities, yeah. I don't know if you were pointing to FCA. No. Yeah, this is the back. Well, let's the see if autopilot works on this stuff. It probably will. Not, oh, there you go. Nice. No problem. Yeah. We'll it's, go got the, it's, it's got the little... It's got one line. One little line. That's barely there. Yep. <laughs> Not bad. Yeah, we're going to start you on some back roads and Man. then we'll end up downtown. Should we drop some stuff off? Yeah, sweet artwork. Yeah. A lot of these are part of the Murals in the Market uh, campaign of the past couple years. They do uh, 30 to 40 murals per year okay. with a bunch of international artists and local artists. Yeah. All right, hold this. Yeah. Like look at yourself. Yeah. I'll hold it for you. I yeah. don't need to be in it. Yeah. Okay. Right. What? Are this you? one too. Yep. So you've been in one Tesla before. That was this mine. Is true. This yes. is the only one. So you're yeah. not used to it and all that kind of stuff, right? Correct. But if you feel like gunning it, you're fine. Yeah. I figured we're pretty. <laughs> <laughs> we're pretty free. Take off. I'm just mad at how quiet it is. Smokestack. Yep. Detroit. Very uh, classic Detroit staple. Exactly better smokestack than just a smoking vent. You're mad at how quiet it is. Yeah, because my car is not this quiet. Oh, <laughs> I thought you, wa you wanted it to be loud. <laughs> no. You like that. I get back in my car and I go 25 and it's like screaming. Yeah, this guy drives a Dodge Hellcat, so. Word? No. I'm Me? about you. Oh, no. <laughs> I drive a Ford. Oh, let's see All if that. It, it yells at me for this red light. I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. Don't yeah. worry about it. Yeah. Look at that. Very good. Nice. That was really good. That actually used to not work very well at all. Mm. So that was sick because that was like really early. Mm -hmm. It gave me time to actually stop. Yep. Um, it was like AO chill. What's your take on the uh, on the Tesla's going to be broken in 10 months? That's, they've been saying that for years. Oh, okay. They've been saying that with every with every car release. They say like, oh, nobody's going to buy this car. Oh, like the yeah. Roadster. Yeah. Like no, no, rich people don't want that. They want, you know, Ferraris or whatever. Yeah. Um, that worked. Nobody wants the Model S. It's too expensive. It yeah. doesn't go far. Uh, that works. So. Yeah. Yeah, it's old, old news. Skeptics. Yeah. That's, yeah. That's all. For sure. There's a lot of orange barrels. Yes. <laughs> a lot of Is that where they store them? Um, no, they're... <laughs> But maybe for this project, <laughs> and they're redoing it like patches of sidewalk right now that are okay. messed up. You can get so I'm gonna use autopilot around here, but it's mm -hmm. really not supposed to be. And like this red stuff, like I don't know. We'll see if it gets confused. Yeah, those sort of yellow zones are mm -hmm. like what is that denoting? That's traffic. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not sure yeah. why it thinks there's traffic there, but. Interesting. Yeah, I think it just gets it from Google, and I notice a lot of times in Google, it's like the stoplights mm -hmm. are always yellow, because mm -hmm. obviously people stop there, so. Yeah. What percentage of the time is your car actually dirty? 
like all the time like 90 or 98 80 85 to 90 somewhere in there mm -hmm. then what's the point of power washing so you can take a left on super more <laughs> All right. what you're trying to do. What is this? This is Motor City? Motor City Casino. Sweet. And then they're, that's the city smaller, straight ahead. They're smaller building. Oh, okay. Of right. two. I've been there for a conference, I think. Yeah. Yeah. It's cute. It's a pretty nice skyline. Yeah, it's all right. We got some gems. <laughs> yeah. The Renson is cool. They're about to be building in like two or three years. Mm -hmm. This building that's like all glass. It almost looks like those little wafer cookies you used to get when you were in like elementary school. You know the ones that were like vanilla, yes, chocolate and strawberry. Yes. It looks like those, but it's all glass. It's not wafer. It's no. But that's about to be taller than the Rensen. <laughs> oh, is mm -hmm. the Rensen the tallest one right now? Yes. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Who's building that? Uh, I don't know. A man, Dan? Probably not. Don't panic. All right. Are you talking to the car? Yes. For sure. <laughs> Does it listen to you? No. This is Beacon Park. Cute little park that DTE put up. Yeah. They have cool little uh, happenings. I'm just letting the car do what it wants, so... Oh! Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Alright, I'm taking over. <laughs> There's too much yeah. going on. Actually, take this right. Tesla doesn't account for this uh, quite yet. No, it does. Oh, it does. Yeah, there he's oh, right there. You go. Wow! <laughs> you see that? Even homie in the middle of the street. We got <laughs> yeah. you, dog. <laughs> All right, that's the middle of the whole city. Yeah. It's where everyone goes to make cars. <laughs> no, that's further south. That's where everyone goes to oh. sit on a fig beach. Right here. That's where everyone goes to make cars. Nope. Right here. That's yeah. where everyone goes to make cars. Windsor. Yeah. Canada. So there he is again on the screen. Tariffs. That's a different guy. But no, <laughs> that's terrible. Oh, graphics. what up? A friend. Yeah. Got a friend. Model S. Uh, Are those like the those, scooters? Yeah, those yes. things I keep hearing about. Yep. There's. They're even in Detroit. They, yeah, Are they ruining the city like everyone says? Um, I mean, no. In my hood, they figured out that if you run out the battery, you can use it just like a regular scooter. <laughs> So the kids in the apartments across the street will run out the battery and then use them all day, just like a regular scooter. That's awesome. What does the pedal pub look like on the screen? Oh. Oh my God. Can the Tesla detect the pedal pub? Not I guess all. not. Oh look, it's got some people. <laughs> <laughs> it saw some people. That's crazy. Playing Pokemon Go in Utopia. 2016 was like being on AOL Instant Messenger in like 1998. I can't believe you mentioned that. I mentioned AOL Instant Messenger earlier. In your video? In this video wow. that we're currently making. Wow. That's so Facts. weird. All right, what's up ahead? What's this circle? Um, that's uh, Halo from Halo. Oh. So is this busy right now, or? Mm, it's mm, sort of mid-level. Okay. Not nearly as busy as a weekday. Yeah, that's what I was um, asking. This is all already like. No, annoying. normally on a weekday, like uh, Dan Gilbert has his little uh, crossing guards out here really? all the time. Yeah, like the like every one of these intersections would have like three to four police people wow. being like, well, Why? not police, but. Why is that Dan Gilbert doing that? Um, because he owns enough of this district and has enough employees coming in and out to where he's worked with the the DDP. Yeah, is the acronym. Downtown Detroit Partnership. That's Windsor across, right? Yep. So we're looking at sweet Caesar's Windsor. Yep. Very cool. And I guess the rest of Windsor, whatever there is to do over yeah, there. I, um, and you'll get in the far right, basically. Maybe the second to. Yeah, you don't want to go to Canada. Yeah. Oh, geez, I didn't even notice that. Yeah. A lot of people don't. Yeah. And then they end up. 
I'm not ready for that. In Canada. You see the red sign now has the, the Chrysler logo up top? Oh, cool. You got to wait for the GM logo. They made it digital a couple years ago. Oh, okay. So. Uh, oh, that's right. That's right. I've seen that. Going. Um, this is Canada. Oh, oh, it's River Days. Go in this right lane. A bunch of these people are going to be pulling in. Um, it's River Days, actually. But it's not Canada. It's not Canada. Okay, then I'm good. River Days is a little popping festival. So, this is actually a tougher time to get this photo. This than kid usual. loves the Tesla. Did you see him? Yeah. Yeah, he's looking at it. Tight. <laughs> he's like, wow. Look at, look at it. It's, it's getting a good, you know, three. Oh, mm -hmm. It's got three out of those, like, 50 people. Not bad. Is it supposed to be, like, that solid at sensing people? No, it's just supposed to know their, I mean, I don't know. Yeah. I guess ideally, yeah, it would see everybody. But no, it's just supposed to kind of know there's people there. I mean, this is pretty crazy. I've never, so I'm not usually in a city, yeah. right? And so I don't get to see this kind of stuff that it sees. It's, it's not doing a bad job, but it's, like, up on the sidewalk, and it's still mm -hmm. detecting them there. It's pretty sweet. Yep. All right, we'll use autopilot and all this busyness. Hopefully, wow. somebody runs out in front of us and you know sees that the car will stop. Oh, I was wondering where that was going. <laughs> it's like, dang. <laughs> no, I don't want to come to the city and just start hitting people, huh? No. Ten points. People are like boating on the river and stuff. Yeah. It's so fun. Suit crew. Yeah. Damn, are y'all warm or what? <laughs> I would be suffering. Oh, no, they got one suitless buddy. Is he with them? Oh, no, he's not. That's Secret Service yeah. for somebody, for some like old R&B artist. Smokey Robinson is in town tonight. All right. All right, leaving, leaving downtown. 30. Auto. I'm autopilot right now, man. If I could do this, uh, navigate to Eastern Market. There. Nice. Is this where we got to get over here? Um, no. Oh, it's doing it. But it's doing it, so. All right, we'll let it. Yeah, we'll it's look. taking you a, a different way than I usually go. But let the car figure it out. Yeah, we'll let it do its thing. Looks like you'll still end up in the right place. We gotta go that way. It's not gonna cross the solid line. <laughs> the problem there. All right, failure. City failure. Yep. Oh, city. No, <laughs> no. The car should. Uh, straight. The car should know. All right. And then you'll take a right here. Yeah, just what it wants you to do. I made these banners, Whoa. little banners, banners on the light poles. Nice, local four. Yep, on my computer. That's awesome. So this is sweet. This is just like a little Detroit neighborhood. Yep, everybody. this is a uh, Boston Edison district. Okay, they have uh, districts, huh? Lots of, yeah, well, it's a neighborhood, but okay. that's what it's called. Okay. And uh, yeah, a lot of big, very old homes. A lot of like Ann Arbor similarities. Right. That's good, that's good. Don't yell at me, car. Alright. Okay. Thanks. Yep. Much Thank love. you for the Detroit tour. Yes, of course. And I'll see you. Goodbye, YouTube. <laughs>
See you next time. Like and subscribe. <laughs> Thanks. See you. <ya. laughs> All right, so that's like a little tour of Detroit. Uh, we did some highway driving with Navigate and Autopilot, and it did work really well. It got us where we needed to go. And then also we were using it in the city, uh, and there it, you know, it's not really designed for that, but it, it did okay. It was really interesting seeing it uh, detect all the people. Uh, okay, changing lanes. But uh, that's it. I'm not going to stop by the supercharger. I was thinking about going to the Livonia supercharger, but it's not actually on my way. Um, and I've been out long enough, I want to get home. So that's going to be it for this one. Any questions, leave them below, uh, and I will see you next time.